My name is uh, Peter Balko. I'm the team leader in the interior department of Mercedes-Benz. S-Class is the car of the brand. It's, let's say, it's the biggest challenge you can get in this company. I start to thought about the company, the brand, what is the value, what is the character, what are the customers, yeah? what is the, the whole world uh, of the brand, to, to, ex to find a way how to express it then later in a particular proposal for the interior. For me, it's more a living space for the passengers and the driver than, than a car. When you are perceiving interior, when you open the door, the first thing what you see is the colors, yeah, is the material, and then you start to see the shape described by this material. We say for the S class, we use only original materials, like the leather is a real leather, it's a high quality leather, well done with very nice, precise stitching. Of course, it invites you to touch these surfaces to touch the nice, precisely done stitching in the leather, to touch all the little structures in the aluminium buttons. It makes you feel to, to control it, to, to push it. If you use a wooden application, then it's a real wood. Yeah, it's always a real wood. And then we have uh, used a lot of high precision uh, aluminium parts. The quality that is very typical for Mercedes is the perception of the materiality, the shape and the precision and it's all in, in one harmony all together. It gives you the all over feeling and in the S-Class I think it's specific the feeling that it's um, something you can relax in. So the S-Class interior has uh, built in a fragrance uh, container that gives uh, the car a specific, very pleasant smell. I have to admit uh, that the steering wheel somehow becomes uh, my favorite part. Yeah? It's a surprise to me as well. On the very beginning I was not so sure, but nowadays when I see it in the car, in the interior, even driving around, so there is a driver sitting in there and is turning around the steering wheel, I always have the feeling that it fits. It fits really well into the interior and it is something special. Uh, and then behind the steering wheel, you have the hood and underneath this generous big hood, you have our display unit. We call it a display unit, it is optically a unit. Uh, basically, these are two displays, but we wanted to connect it in one unit. So it's uh, aesthetically, it, it's a, uh, simpler. The left screen, the driver screen, is uh, having the function as usually it's the driver information, speed and so on, night vision, and, but because it's a display it's more flexible. And on the middle screen, on the, on the right side, you have all the navigation system, entertainment and uh, really impressive animation. The ambient light, we use it to exaggerate all these elements, like the screen, so we have the backlight, uh, of the screen that makes it optically even more floating in the space under the hood and we have the ambient light along the aluminium and wooden pieces so exaggerating again the all-over character and the architecture of the interior and as well we have it uh, in the middle tunnel coming from the front even to the back of the car. Another very strong feature or element design feature of the S-Class, and that's not typical only for S-Class, but most of the Mercedes cars, is the so-called S-Wave. That's the shape of the wooden application or the whole dashboard volume, the, the S-Wave. So if you see it from the plan view or from the rear view, you will see a nice elegant wave that is continuing into the doors, wrapping around the passenger again. And it gives you a nice swing, feels elegant, feels dynamic and uh, gives you very cozy room to, to uh, spend the time. Let me mention still uh, our four air vents in the middle of the dashboard and the analog watch. Four air vents, it's, uh, it has kind of a heritage and it gives you possibility to make these air vents a little bit smaller. There is still some technical reasons behind it so when you have four of them each of them can be a bit smaller and that's 
aesthetically nicer. So it has really nice haptics. If you move it up and down, it makes a little click click. It's nice details. And the analog watch in the middle. We decided consciously for the analog watch and not the digital, some high-tech uh, feature to show the, the contrast maybe between this display unit, this huge high-tech unit on the top of the dashboard and the analog very classy and long-lasting, timeless, timeless piece underneath. It gives you a nice contrast and uh, very high quality feeling. I hope that the overall feeling or the reaction will be like, wow, of course, yeah. So it's the, the best of the best. That's, was, that was our approach to make the best car of the world. It's, it's our flagship of our brand. So we put in a lot of effort into, to achieve this, this goal. Uh, S-Class interior is really talking to all your senses. 